splash. Because I like that one. Um, 68. There we go. So, let's see that we might say not right I can't use my arrow keys really okay. so begin with energy begin with energy so there we go wait for it So the mod wheel doesn't affect the sound. I'm gonna turn, <laughs> disable the record. Um, let's go back. Sounds like it might be the end of something, but uh, we can we can sort of we can come up with some solutions. Uh, okay, what do we got over here?
do I want to do that or do I want to play chords? in this one so I may actually try it now this is of course ooh, 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 hitting my stuff this is I will come back to that um, oh here we go That's like dead on. Mm, okay, we can fix this with. Um, he's got all these regular contact. So, to use was a uh, sort of a muted trumpet for this particular so it's on dand dand horns trumpet trumpet meat okay now I think maybe maybe I should use a saxophone instead uh, because that's kind of the effect I was going for. And if I don't find a good one here, I have one in my keyboard, so. Yeah, well, maybe the trumpet is the best one. Um. Yeah. Uh, or we could go with a regular trumpet. What do we got? Next one. Bottom trumpet section. doing anything till I turned it on. I might actually poke out too much. Mm. Ba -da -ba -da. a little bit um, it's okay so full trumpet and we're not done yet because it needs a really cool uh, effect I think delay 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 clear filter hmm I use replica or I could use replica XT. Let me use XT, see what that does. Okay. There's 
into that too much. <laughs> uh. Where's our mix? There we go. More dry. Okay, so we're gonna go 1090. I like the init sound already. That's a little bit too much. Half the thing is just shaping the sounds. A little bit too much. I'm going to dial that back down. Yeah, that's what I'm running. Okay. <laughs> now let's see. <clears throat> Immediately, I'm just going to start tracking it. If I get any good ideas, it'll they'll be there. Okay, we'll go with that. That sounds kind of solemn. But what I'm picking up here, uh, trying to get uh, organized here, eh, is the tones. So. Okay, we still need a bass, and I'm going to pick. Um, I'm going to take something a little bit more. Solid. Now, what I usually use is, uh, in, in this case, what I like with these sounds is like a sub bass. And I'm going to again pull from contact. Uh, was this in the factory library? I think it was still in the factory library. So, synth, bass, uh, Is this right? <laughs> well, see, I used the factory selection back when I did this, so it was more like a... not monster base. Oh. Hmm. Okay, we're going to use a factory library and go back to synth. Well, let's just see what we come up with. Nope. Um, let me use. Okay. Yeah. That's not nice sounding.
La da 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 da. The dangers of doing live. <laughs> okay. And. Mmm, vintage, vintage. Okay. Vintage. And. Mm, okay, here we go. That's right. It was the old school stuff. This has more of a pluck on it. Just three. Nope. <laughs> Too plucky. I'm thinking it was two that I liked more. Six. So it's between two and six, I think. Because one was kind of. Sounds like that supersonic thing from the. So, so. Let's hear it in context because that's that's what matters right now. Uh, and so in context. Change the pitch down to six. I think that's about right. Okay. <clears throat> Here we go. Now, I may. <laughs> I may just mute the um, the trumpet at this point. Where is the trumpet? The trumpet is, of course, right here. Because I want to do it in time with the... Uh... However, since they're all playing together, the, the effect is good with this. Like, so.
I don't know if that base drop worked on the end. Well, let's see. Okay. Yeah. 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 Doesn't have to be a lot. You just you just have to have the feel there. So. Okay. That's good. Or should we go with strings? Hmm. Let's go with. Let's see what the hypha thing will do here. <laughs> Ah, okay, okay, okay. Since since we're going with brass, uh, open up again. Contact. Oh, wrong place. Contact. <laughs> oh, they're playing together. Let's uh, let's remove one of them. Give it a little more pop. We need a tighter horn sound, don't we? Let's see. Oh, I actually have the ensemble horns. A little too big. I has I, I'm I'm holding off on trying this one because Not bad, actually. Um, rip. Mm 
<laughs> I don't I don't want it to I don't want it to 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 rip the whole time though. Okay, sustain. Uh, drop off. Ooh. Polyphonic, that's good. Chord plus legato? What's that? Still loading. <laughs> Come on, load, load. There we go. Wow, so smooth. So. have too much fun and not actually do anything so but that does give me um, oh we'll just call it horns because it has horns but it does have a saxophone in it which is kind of uh, you know <laughs> so. see what octave we want to play at <laughs> Let's, uh, let's, let's do it. And maybe they shouldn't come in right away. going to come in here and we're going to friendly ba -da -ba -ba -ba. oh come on i'm confusing my shortcuts because i go back and forth between uh, uh not shortcuts but the uh modifiers because i go between windows and uh um mac <laughs> so, all right, so is that too long let's see Handy little play button down here.
too long. Okay, I'm going to put the playhead right where that sound ends. And I'm going to put them right there. Okay, that's a clean end. I can probably, with the articulations in session horns, do some more uh, more things with that. So we have our initial sound now, uh, which is a one more instrument, and then we'll we'll pause this for the time being. But contact. Uh, use my own tips and <laughs> actually type in contact i'm going to use this one this time oh we can just hit piano keys or keys piano keys um yeah let's use this one since we're going for a let's see pick a Try that one to start with. Oh, it's a felt. So it's near the end where I want to put in my thing. So we'll come in right about here. And then we'll say... Oh, not the right one. Huh? What's it doing? Ah.
So now that those are the tones, we're going to stop that. We're going to save that. That's a tone we're going for. I will need to get the notes a little better, obviously. But uh, let's you know, put this in more. All right. So coming out here, one last play through. So. it to be in pure okay right. got that one where was the score there we go okay let's use that one All right this is a nice thing I can change the sound after I've already <laughs> already recorded it so things that we've used before and that is that we are going to use the chords so look here we in even uh, actually let me change that to on drama yeah and now I don't see it hmm. <laughs> that's fun yeah go for it There's some weird stuff happening, probably in the effects section. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> no, let's go for um, eh, studio and tape. Okay. Yeah.
Okay, uh, this should be good. Uh, and we'll click this in whereabouts. No, I can't see what I'm doing. Okay, there we go. So somewhere in So here we go. Oh, huh. Now, I need to make sure I click here before I use that Okay, so and we'll stop and we'll save. So now that I got the tones, I just need to get the uh, get the the <laughs> chord progression. I was exploring a bit with the piano there, but let's see how we put together. What did we put together? Some synth sounds and acoustic sounds, and made something nice.